The branches of mathematics. Math is everywhere, from the shapes of planets to the properties of atoms, our universe is completely mathematical. Math is a study of relationships among quantities, structures, and space, and also of the logical operations by which they may be deduced. The history of mathematics is nearly as old as humanity itself. Mathematics has been fundamental to advances in science, engineering, and philosophy. It has evolved from simple counting, measurement, and calculation, and the systematic study of the shapes and motions of physical objects through the application of abstractation, imagination, and logic to the broad, complex, and often abstract discipline that we know today. Arithmetic is a branch of mathematics that consists of the study of numbers, especially the properties of the traditional operations on them, addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division. These operations are denoted by the given symbols. Arithmetic is a foundation upon which all other advanced mathematics are built. Additionally, arithmetic is the aspect of math that people are most familiar with. Algebra is a kind of arithmetic where we use unknown quantities along with numbers. These unknown quantities are represented by letters of the alphabet, such as X, Y, A, B, etc., or even symbols. The use of letters helps us to generalize the formulas and rules that you write and also helps you find the unknown missing values in algebraic expressions and equations. Algebra is critically important because it is often viewed as a gatekeeper to higher level mathematics. Geometry is a branch of mathematics concerned with questions of shape, size, relative position of figures, and the properties of space. The basic elements of geometry are points, lines, angles, surfaces, and solids. Geometry helps build spatial reasoning, helping us understand how we are oriented among objects and how those objects are in relation to one another. It also helps with logical thinking, as concepts in geometry are derived by deductive reasoning drawing on the laws of logic. Trigonometry is a study of relationships between angles and sides of triangles. There are primarily three trigonometric functions commonly used with trigonometric identities to solve complex equations. These include sine, cosine, and tangent functions. Trigonometric calculations are a part of geometry that assist in finding out the exact value of the opposing sides of a triangle, even if only one side and an angle is known to you. It mostly deals with right triangles. Trigonometry is used in various branches of physics. Calculus is a branch of mathematics that deals with the finding and properties of derivatives and integrals of functions by methods originally based on the summation of infinite differences. Differential calculus is a subfield of calculus that studies the rates at which quantities change. The basic idea of integral calculus is finding the area under a curve and lengths of curves primarily with integrals. Calculus is used to gain a more precise understanding of the nature of space, time, and motion. For centuries, mathematicians wrestled with paradoxes involving division by zero or sums of infinitely many numbers. Calculus helps us answer these questions and is also used to understand motion. Statistics is a discipline that concerns the collection, organization, analysis, interpretation, and presentation of data. Statistics studies methodologies to gather, review, analyze, and draw conclusions from data. Probability is a branch of mathematics concerning numerical descriptions of how likely an event is to occur or how likely it is that a proposition is true. Statistical and probability knowledge helps you use the proper methods to collect the data, employ the correct analysis, and effectively present the results. These areas are a crucial process behind how we make discoveries in science, make decisions based on data, and how we make predictions. I hope that you've learned about the branches of mathematics and their significance. Thank you!